Good morning. Or is it afternoon? It's still morning. <laughs> Good morning. We are going to head somewhere that we haven't been in kind of, you haven't been in forever. I'm so excited. Yeah, we're going to Volcano <laughs> Bay. Yeah. It's exciting. It is, I mean, I can't really do anything in Volcano Bay, but I just like want to be at a, a water park. Yeah. I want to be in the Lazy River. I want to be, I think I can go in the Fast River. Yeah. Yeah, and then yeah. the wave pool. I'm pretty darn excited. And yeah. the food, I just want to have lunch. It'll be delicious. Oh yeah. yeah. Also, we can't film on any of the rides, but we can film the wave pool, we can film the lazy river, oh, we can film... I want the ice cream too. Oh yeah. The Watori like rainbow ice cream, I want that. Also, I think what we might do is, so back when Volcano Bay first opened, the rules weren't super clear yet. I, I don't know that they were strictly enforcing everything right. yet. So we were able to film on a few things in the very beginning of Volcano Bay. So what I'll do is I'll insert some older footage from the slides so you can see what Tim's doing. So you guys can actually get an idea of what the rides are like. So that's, yeah. Also, we we're not there yet. I might just stay with you the whole day. Well, I have a feeling you're going to want to ride something. You never know. <laughs> well, Let's head on over and we'll yeah. see what happens. Yeah. There it is, Volcano Bay. We will be inside of you in just one minute. So we've made it to the parking garage. We're headed towards the bus stop to get on a bus, go to Volcano Bay's security check, go through security, then walk up an escalator to get to Volcano Bay. It's kind of a process. So things are constantly changing here. We already went through bag check. Yeah. It's usually over at the other bus stop. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, I didn't know that. It's been so long. But now we're getting on a bus to head to Volcano Bay. Oh, they're being real quiet, but they're giving us some information on the Tapu Tapu. We've done a whole video about how to use the Tapu Tapu, and we will leave that in the description down below. So that was about a five minute bus ride, and now we're walking down these ramps. Then we make a left and go underneath the road, and this is where the theming starts. It's like we're already inside of a volcano, or at some form of bay. I like how everything looks like primitive island lights and support structure. Primitive island escalators. That was about a minute walk from the bus to here. So all in all, from parking the car, getting on the bus, making it over here to the front entrance, I'd say about 15 minutes. Yeah, not bad at all. Yeah. I'm so happy that we're here. The volcano is actually erupting right now. If I zoom way in on it, you can see it erupting at the very top. Good afternoon, King Julian. Thank you for inviting us to the Volcano Bay. Ooh, nice look at that. Oh, oh, nice to meet you. <laughs> yes. Kiss the ring. <laughs> you love yeah. It. Yeah, this is so, you love it too? He lives here? Oh, you you live, live here? here? I thought you lived in Madagascar. Well, he's here on vacation. Oh, he's here on vacation. Okay. We do know that he likes to move it, move it. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. What's that? What does that mean? Oh, waves. Julian. Gotcha. Okay. <laughs> clap, stomp, stomp, clap. Trying to figure out what to eat for lunch. Stop by Kohala Reef. See what kind of stuff they have here. I was looking at this edamame quinoa burger. Ooh. That sounds pretty good. Yeah. But they also have some grab and go options in case you just want to like real quick bite. Should we look at the other places and see what they have? Yeah, let's look around. So in that video where I describe how to use the Tapu Tapu, I did it all over here in the North Beach Pavilion and they didn't have this the last time. Now there's just like a quick service, almost like a cart over here. Oh no, it's a full out shack. They built a whole shack back there. Wow, I had no idea. Today is intensely busy. There are a lot of people here today. It is so hot. So I think we're actually going to put our stuff down and get into the water and then maybe get something to eat. Yeah. Because it's really warm. So as I've always said, the Rainforest Village locker rooms and restrooms are the least crowded ones. All right, we are now switching to the GoPro and we will be out in the water. I got my UV shirt on. I know some of, some of you guys might get mad because this is a Disney shirt, but uh, I have to wear this because I need to like limit my sun exposure. Right. So, sorry, it's a Disney shirt. <laughs> but these are awesome though. If you guys are ever looking for something that's like on top of your sunscreen, these are great. I'm sure they sell them here too. Yeah. Yeah, but I love these. So let's do it. Let's hit the fast moving Lazy River. One of the requirements of the fast moving Lazy River, Te Awa, the Fearless River, is everybody has to wear a light vest. Yeah. So we got ours on. They look really cool. Yeah. <laughs> and we're ready to, to Lazy River it up. It's really nice. The temperature's not too cold and it's not too hot. It feels good. But it is very crowded. Yeah.
Jen, Jen had to switch her life vest for a smaller size because yeah. it was riding up too much. I thought I would need a larger size with my belly, but it doesn't really go over your belly that much. No. Yeah. Life starts splashing people. This is a cool Instagram oh. shot. Oh no! <laughs> It's like coming out of the water too and just spraying people right in the face. And now that we've gotten cooled off a little bit, now we can go get something to eat. Here we go. We're gonna eat at Bamboo Jungle Kitchen some rainforest flavors. They have almost the same stuff that they had at that last place that we were looking at. You're gonna get the quinoa burger? Maybe. I'm still deciding. Ooh. Oh, I've never. This one looks good too. Sorry, I've never seen the desserts. I might get this cookie. That burger does look good. It has. Uh, I like that it comes on a Hawaiian bun. Oh yeah. I might get this belly burger. Here's our receipt. And I just want to show you guys how much we actually saved. Saved $6 because of my new annual pass. Also, I got a Perrier. And why was that cheaper than the regular water? Look at that. Those are the macadamia nuts. I love that they do these like compostable, recycled bowls and plates and things like that. Here's our food. That's my belly burger with pork belly on it. Oh, it looks good. And sloth. And then some french fries. And Jen's lovely edamame burger. It looks kind of sad. Doesn't it? Uh, but I also asked for cheese on the side. Well, I, I'd asked for it on the burger, but they put it in a bowl on the side. <laughs> Probably because it's a vegetarian thing and they're like, oh, oh I don't yeah. Know. No, that makes sense. That makes sense. It looks pretty good, though. Yeah. This stand here used to sell pearls, and now it's a bar. So it's called the Pura Bar. Almost like it said pearl, but they changed it to an A. And so now it just sells drinks. They have special reserve seating for those that need wheelchair access. Also, look at how crowded the wave pool is. Holy cow. It is very cold inside of this wave pool right now. This is definitely colder than the river. Yeah, for it's sure. You know why it's so cold? Why? Because all that water coming down the mountain is being aerated with the exterior air, so it's cooling it off. Evaporation. Science. <laughs> you did it! It's not cold anymore, right? No, it's really cold. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely a, a busy day here today. We found a pool that doesn't have very many people in it. So like, we're some of the only people in this pool. Ooh. Hidden pool. It's out in the open. There's, oh, okay. No, sorry. We're going, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Kokiri body plunge, 170 minute wait. Oof. And now into the lazy river. Yeah, time to get lazy. It's super warm in here. It is really warm. It feels like bath water. Yeah. Whee! There it goes. <laughs> The vegetation's so thick here, you used to be able to see through this to see who you were splashing. Not anymore. Got him. We're gonna take an adventure into the volcano. We can get in there here, right? I don't know. We'll find out. I feel like if we just like go through here, we should be able to get in there. Ooh, they're having fun. We did it. We have found the volcano. 
and it sounds like we can hear the spirit of the volcano. I have a strong inner power which allows me to look inside you and I can see your inner current. And I can read that for you, just like you see the colors of the rainbow. You girls are loving and playful. And your color current inside is a beautiful, vibrant yellow. Pretty light fish. And then it spits up onto the ceiling. Magic. Ooh, yeah, this is the one that I want to do. And then that turns on those, and then we can control them right here, and we can spray people. Like, I'm gonna spray this guy down here. Ooh. baptismal font of Volcano Bay. Back with the other camera, and what we're gonna do now is walk around and kind of have a look at the slide, see what the wait times are like, and probably put in some point of views from when we were actually able to ride the slides. Oh, I thought that this was some sort of interactive element. That's just the fish's eyeball. Is it a barracuda? Maybe. Yeah. Kind of looks like it, doesn't it? Ooh, a barracuda. Oh. Making our way back here by Maku Puihi, and these are the slides that scare the heck out of Jen. These are the, ones that the raft that you're in. It's so overinflated. We like bounced out of it. Oh yeah. So I was. It was fun, but it was scary. Oh, admittedly, it's not a very long wait. 25 minutes for Maku, and Puihi's right now. Nice. So the yellow one is Maku, and the green one is Puihi. And you can kind of see the overinflated tubes here, little honeycomb tubes. Oh, Ooh, they are coming out. And backwards. Oh! 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 Okay. Okay. Oh, we made it. Oh! Oh! Jeez, Louise. Oh, now I'm going back. Oh, no. Oh, 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 my goodness gracious. This is going fast. Oh, oh, oh. Oh dear. Oh, oh, oh. Over here by Punga Racers, this is my favorite ride in the whole park. I just love mat slides. They're so much fun. Yes. Well, this is new. They've changed the weight limit for Punga Racers. I can no longer ride this ride. Because your weight cannot exceed 150 pounds. Wow. Well, now that I can't ride that, I guess my favorite ride is Krakatau, which is their aqua coaster.
but unfortunately Krakatau's wait time or return time I should say is 145 minutes so if I tap my tapu tapu I'd have to wait out in the park 145 minutes before getting on the ride the two slides that are always ride now which is basically just like any other water park in the world where you just kind of wait for it are the Taniwa tubes the blue slide and the green slide these are my favorite after the roller coaster the water coaster yeah after Krakatau. I love these and also we can ride these because the weight limit hasn't changed yeah yeah <laughs> also theoretically these slides should put through a lot of people because there's two on either side and each one carries two people all right jen you ready yeah oh my god this is the slow one too Whoa. The forecast said that it was going to start raining around 2. It is going on 2.30 now, so looking pretty good. Soon, Jen. Soon. We're going to take him into Tatiki Reef over there. It's actually... I, I can't wait. Like, this is what I'm so excited is to just show him the theme parks. Oh, yeah. Because we love the theme parks. So I think it'll be really fun. Yeah. I'm very excited. I'm going to teach him how to swim before he can even walk. Yeah, he definitely needs to have swim lessons for sure. Being a Florida baby and right? a pool. And like the beaches and yeah for sure yeah time to get the watery fusion rainbow, rainbow last time it wasn't very rainbow so we'll see if it's rainbow this time so the last time that we got this it wasn't very bright but today it seems like it's kind of good yeah it's pretty bright today yeah yeah i love it nice what do you think mm. well you got it on your chin that's what you're supposed to do, it's ice cream cone. No, no, that's why I shaved my mustache. <laughs> really oh no, he's tired. Me too, Tiki man. I wonder what this guy's name is. I don't know if he has a name. Mm. I like it. Yeah. You can taste the different flavors, I didn't think you'd be able to. It's very banana-y. Oh, just at the top though, right? Mm -hmm. I like that they serve it in one of those little things that you get the, the like, cinnamon almonds in. <laughs> yeah. Can I get it all over my face? You got it? No, you're good. <laughs> Still good. Yeah. That's very <laughs> banana -y. He's laughing at you because you have stuff all over your face. Good. Yeah. And it was, I think, like five fifty with our annual pass discount. Water park, duck hanging out near the stream. It's like the most tranquil setting for a duck. If I were a duck, this is where I'd be. He's waiting for you to throw in your change so he can take it and buy ice cream. Oh no, I thought ducks love sun chips. And ice cream. There's that storm rolling in. Theme park alligator thinks that it might rain. <laughs> I think you might be right. What do you think about the ice cream? It tastes a lot like banana. There was a lot of banana in there. Yeah, but it was good. Yeah, I liked it. The orange was really good, but there wasn't enough of it. Right? Here's a look at the lazy river from above. There are definitely a lot of people here today. But that looks extra lazy. Being a Floridian is kind of weird. Because in the in the bathroom, I was talking to one of the team members here. And he's like, thank you, you too. He's like, what would you ride today? I was like, nothing. <laughs> like, who goes to Volcano Bay and is like, didn't ride a darn thing. Well, I think because we have an annual pass, that's yeah. why we do it. If we paid for a, like a day park admission, I would ride everything. Right? Did want to show you guys, cabanas are sold out, premium seating sold out, but they do still have express available for today and towels, of course. Also, over here is a people dryer. I like that it's like Iron Man and Incredible Hulk colors mixed together. <laughs> I thought it looked like a watermelon. Oh yeah. But these never work. Do not waste your money on Right, it's like $5 and you will still be wet yeah. afterwards. With the imposing storm ahead of us, I think we are going to bid Volcano Bay adieu. But I had such a fun day. It was nice. It was real. I love being at the water park. Yeah. My little tapu tapu just vibrated oh. at me and said like, hey, Mine too. don't it's forget it. to drop me off. Yeah. There we go. So we just realized that we never talked about our lunch. Oh yeah. yeah what did you think? I liked it. I thought it was good. Yeah. yeah I didn't really like yours. 
It was pretty spicy because it had a sriracha mayo on it, but the burger itself was kind of sweet because yeah. it had like sweet peppers and I thought it was a nice balance of sweet and spicy. I, I enjoyed it. But what did you think of your lunch? It was delicious. Yeah? It was like a regular burger, like a quick surf burger, but then it had the pork belly on it and the pork belly was like a teriyaki glazed pork belly. So it was kind of sweet too? Yeah. Yeah. It was delicious with like a sweet slaw underneath it. The fries were really good too. They were nice and crispy and they had a little bit of seasoning on them. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I thought it was like a pretty good lunch. And then typical macadamia nut. Thank you. <laughs> and then and then typical macadamia nut cookie. Oh yeah, they were delicious. Yeah. I actually think I liked those better than the ice cream. Oh really? Yeah, the ice cream was good, but it was way too much banana flavor. Right. But the cookies were really good. But the ice cream way more Instagrammable. That's true. So, all in all, a fantastic day. I love Volcano Bay. Yeah, it's such a fun place to come. Yeah. So with that being said, we are off. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Hey, it's Nick from Volcano Bay. Now it's time to pay the price.